she just embodied kindness, empathy, compassion. The woman sitting in the chair in this photo is Moira Hughes, a longtime nursing instructor at Chemeketa Community College, where she touched the lives of so many nurses in training, including Bethany Tapio. She was so reassuring that we could do it and um, cheering us on while also, you know, meeting the objectives of what we needed to learn as nurses. She was one of those um, instructors that just um, genuinely cared not just about growing up nurses, but who we were as people. It makes what happened to Moira all the more tragic. Authorities say early Saturday morning, Moira and her husband were in their Kaiser home on Trail Avenue Northeast when a suspected drunk driver plowed into the house. Moira was killed. Her husband, George Heights, badly injured. To be sitting in the safety and the comfort of your home and have your life you know, be ended and in her husband's case, you know, dramatically shattered and changed profoundly in an in instant. Um, yeah, that just, it, that morning, I just thought that that could be us, my husband and I in our living room. It's hard to fathom, even for the most seasoned detectives who identify the driver as 41-year-old Andrew Modine of Kaiser. Court documents allege that a witness found Modine behind the wheel of his car, singing and headbanging to the music blaring. Court documents also indicate that at the time of the crash, Modine was on probation for a prior DUII that, according to the Oregonian, resulted in his own brother's death. If anyone would have a forgiving, empathetic spirit towards this person, it was Moira. A sentiment echoed by Bethany Tapio. This is what nursing is. And when I say Moira embodied nursing, that's what she embodied, that love and compassion and care and acceptance of somebody no matter who they are, no matter what they've done. Our thoughts are certainly with Moira's family and friends. As for the suspect in this case, he's facing eight charges, among them manslaughter, assault, reckless driving, and DUII.